Hello, Life Has No Control Alt Delete fans. I'm Kevin Ripa, and this is My Sans 3 Minutes Max. As promised in the last episode, we are going to do a series on USB investigations. Obviously, USB devices can come up very often in digital forensics cases, and uh, a lot of people use them to conduct activity that they shouldn't have been conducting because they believe that once they unplug it, well, it's no longer there to provide any information. But that's simply not true. So we're going to look at uh, some of the information that we can collect from a hard drive specific to a USB device itself. And using this stuff, we can then correlate activity to a device or tell someone, hey, we know there's another device that you haven't given us. Before we get started, there's going to be, if you're going to follow along, a few, uh, something that you're going to want. So uh, as you can see here, we have a USB data demo sheet uh, on the screen. And you can download this, a copy of this, from the website that's on your screen. And this is some of the information that we're going to be collecting about this drive, including uh, the volume serial number, first connected, last connected, last disconnected, great, great stuff. And so what are we going to need? Where are we going to get this stuff from? Well, we're going to use Registry Explorer uh, for this uh, quest, and we're going to be loading three different registry hives, a system hive, a software hive, and add an ntuser.dat hive. We don't know which one yet, but we'll talk about how we can figure out which one as we go forward. So the first thing that we want to know is we want to know the vendor of the device. But before we can even do that, we have to drill down into our system hive and we have to go and figure out what control set our computer has. Because if it has multiple control sets, you need to know which one you want. And the way that we can find that is we click on the setup folder, beg your pardon, the select folder, and you can see there's current and last known good. We are interested in the current one, and we see that uh, the data here is one. Current is one. Current control set is one. So you can see here now, we go back to our system hive, we see control set 001. That is our current control set. Very commonly, you may see uh, control set 002, 003. These are caused, if you have an error or there's an error on the computer, it does a hard crash. Uh, when the computer starts, it'll say, do you want to restore from last known good? It will look at the last known good control set and boot from there. If you say no, it will create a new control set and boot from there. So it's very common to see computers with more than one control set. We only have one control set, and that's the one that we're going to be digging into uh, for the next uh, few episodes. So in the meantime and in between time, that's it. Another episode of 3 Minutes Max.